presented by Church Tech U. It's the Pro Presenter Show. On today's show, looping background retriggering and why it's no longer an issue in Pro Presenter 7.4. Hi, and welcome again to the Pro Presenter Show. This is the show where I help you learn all about Pro Presenter. My name is Paul Allen Clifford. Pro Presenter, and more specifically, Renewed Vision, have been very, very responsive with coming out with new updates that fix problems that have even been problems with ProPresenter for years and years. This is one such thing. In fact, I know all the way back to at least ProPresenter 3, it was the case that ProPresenter would do this, even though people that were not familiar with it wouldn't necessarily expect it to. So what is it? Well, let's head over to my computer and we'll uh, take a look. So let's imagine that you've got a song, in this case, Amazing Grace, and you've got a background video that you've drugged down from the media bin uh, up here so that it triggers when you click on a slide, just like this. Okay, all's well and good. Then you click on different lyrics and lyrics show up. Um, that particular one has a black background. I meant to remove that, but anyway. So you're clicking on different lyrics. With ProPresenter um, 7.3 all the way back, if you were to click on this slide again, it would start over, the video would. But they have fixed that so that it doesn't by default. Now, uh, let me give you a couple of caveats with this. This is only backgrounds. So it, if I had a foreground video, let's say, this one let's make sure that the behavior is set to foreground okay it's the exact same video file but I'm just gonna drag that up there okay so this is a foreground video this is a background video now if I click on the foreground video you'll notice that it restarted if I click on it again it restarted so it will re-trigger foreground videos just not background videos also someone asked on the ProPresenter users group, what if you fill a lower third with a video? Will it re-trigger that? The answer is yes, it will re-trigger that as well. So the only instance where looping background re-triggering is fixed is with looping backgrounds. So if I had this background here, See, this one's set to stop. This one is set to loop. If I had it set to stop, then when it stopped, it would re I could re-trigger it. But that would be an odd circumstance. So foreground videos do still re-trigger. Uh, videos that are filling in text boxes, they'll re-trigger. Right now, it's only background videos in, um, in ProPresenter 7.4. If you like this content, I bet you'd like my ProPresenter 7 Quick Start course. It's all the very basics of using ProPresenter 7, and I've gotten a lot of great feedback on it from uh, the hundreds of churches that have taken it. So if that's something that you find interesting, just go to tdm.fyi slash pro7quick, and you can sign up there, and I'll make a login for you so that you can take it at your leisure. Until next time, this is Paul Allen Clifford from trinitydigitalmedia.com and churchtechu.com reminding you to go out and change eternity. <laughs>